It's me again. Are you ready? You're going to need your shoes on today, please. And you'll need upper body weights only, a pair of upper body weights. Uh, we'll be picking those up. So make sure it's something that you can handle, but still something challenging for the upper body. And uh, let's uh, get going. If you've got a heart rate monitor, start it up for me, please. I'm finding some, 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 and I'd like you to just start marching it out. That's it. Just start marching it out for me, please. Nice and easy. Let's take those glasses off. So, as with most rev your engines, we're going to have a little bit of cardio. We're going to have a little bit of strength training. Yeah, and we're gonna try and aim for a nice solid set today. Let's see what we can do. We're gonna try some new moves today. So, uh, well, I shouldn't say new, we've done them before, but we haven't done them very regularly. So I'm gonna give you some options as we work through. Good, give me a nice big inhale. Look at your hands as they touch above the head. And exhale, oh, big stretching. Let's go, reach those hands up again. Stretch it out and exhale one more time. Big reach up, reach, 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 reach. And exhale, shake it out, march it out. Nice and steady with those legs. That's it. Good, nice and light with those feet. Just about 20 more seconds of marching. I'm gonna just open up those hips. That's it, excellent job. All right, put all your weight onto your left leg and I'd like you to open up that hip for me, please. Bring it in and then open it out. Take your time here. One more time like that. Beautiful, up high and open, good. Let's do the left leg. Up high and open. So drive that knee higher than the hip. Open it out. One more time. Excellent. That's it. March it out and roll those shoulders back. Squeeze the shoulder blades together. Round the back when you bring the hands forward. Arms forward. That's it. And reverse. Oh, I hear some cracking. So I'm waking up <laughs> and march it back out. That's it, beautiful. Nice steady march here now. So now I want you to think about lifting those knees a little bit higher than what you were just doing. That's it, beautiful. Put all your weight onto your left leg. All right, let's take it up. Pull that knee higher than the hip. Good. One more time. Switch it out other side. Bring that knee higher. Give it a nice little second hold. Try and open up that joint. One more time. Back to that right leg, quad stretch. Release, oh, my quads are tight. That's it. Don't fall over like I just did. There we go. Switch it out from the other side, quad stretch. Try and get that heel to the butt. Try and keep the knees in line. One more time. Excellent. Good job, shake it out for me, please. Start opening up your legs nice and wide. And I want you to come down into a nice deep primal squat, as low as you can. Use those fingers to support the body. Good. Stand it up however you need to. Let's do that again. Down into a primal squat. Oh, that's it. And come back up. Two more times like that. If you need to come butt up first, I'll show you what that looks like. You can. Deep primal squat. Yeah, butt up first, and then you can just roll it up. That's an option. 
One more time, deep primal squat. Let's do some knee drops, just alternate which knee. We know this in our cool down. We do this quite often, don't we? And then come to standing. Beautiful, some chain breakers. And then we are ready to begin. Keep everything at shoulder height. So elbows, wrists, at least shoulder height. So it's gonna build some heat in the body, make the heart work a little harder. Excellent. That's it. Beautiful job. And shake it out. Feel whatever needs to be stretched for you. Maybe you need to like round and release your hips. Maybe you need to round and release your back. Feel it out for yourself. Just shake it out. Okay, are you ready? So, we haven't done this cardio in a while, but we're starting to build up on it. Let's do a repeater. Let's start with that left leg. Come with me. Nice and steady. So I want runner's arms, so there's a 90 degree bend in the elbow. I want you to move those arms back and forth. How fast you go here is entirely up to you. Weight stays in the right foot. The right knee stays bent. The deeper the bend, the harder it is. So if it's feeling like too much, straighten up that right leg. Or if you feel like you need a little bit extra today, bend that knee just a bit more. That's it, keep going nice and steady. That repeater, I like that. We're aiming for that minute mark. We started a little bit late, so we're gonna switch out. All right, let's go. 10 burpees. Take it down and back and up. 10 burpees, that's 10. Down and back and up. Nine. If you can't keep up with me, that's okay. Just go a little bit slower, make it your workout. I'd like you to hop those legs back if possible. Five to go. One more time. Good job. Repeater. Right leg. Let's go. Excellent job. Keep the weight into the left leg now. Keep a bend in those elbows. I'm feeling the heat already. How about you? That's it. One minute. Nearly there. Three, two, back it up. 10 inch worms. So come down, touch the ground, walk your hands out into plank, come back, stand. That's one. Do 10 of these. So if you need to go a little bit slower than me, that's okay. Now make sure you don't drop the butt in the plank or keep it too high. Try and keep the legs as straight as possible. But there's always the option to come down onto the knees. Take a look. Yeah, there's always that option. Okay, this is five, no, four. Let's go, five. Inchworm, total bodies. Many little exercises while we're doing our cardio. Six, come on. Seven, walk it out, plank, walk it back. Eight, two more. One more. Good job. All right. Let's go. High knee or march. Your option. One minute. So 
So I want the legs to come up in front. I want the chest lifted. I want the back flat. Remember, you don't have to hop here if you don't want to. You can just alternate lifting the knee. Stay with it, nice and steady. In five, four, three, that burpee, let's go, 10 of them only. Jump back, stand up. So we're not doing a full burpee. We're not doing the jump. We're not doing that push up. Just want you to hop back if you can. Come to standing as quick as you can. Five, however many you're doing is perfect. Stay with me. Keep moving, keep burpeeing. Two more. One more. That's it. Come to standing. One minute. Kick your butts. Excellent. So now the heel comes up behind you. I want you to tilt forward ever so slightly. So the belly is still braced, but you're kind of leaning forward on it. Are you dripping with sweat yet? Mine's nearly there. It's just hanging on the tip of my nose. Come on. Nice and steady. Make sure those heels are coming behind. Remember, you don't have to hop if you don't want to. Just alternate heel to butt. Can you move those arms? Yes. In five, four, back it up. Inchworms, give me 10 of them. Let's go. So touch your toes, come to plank, come back to standing. That's it. Just keep moving. It's okay if you're going slower or faster. Yep, we have five more to go. Five. Walk it forward into plank. Good job. Four more to go. Remember, you can always drop to those knees if you need to. Maybe try dropping the knees so you can speed it up. Maybe. Two more. Come on, make sure you're standing up each time. That's part of it. That's part of what gives you a little bit of a cardio effect. Last one. Good job. Okay. I want that little hop for me, please. One minute. I'd like you to try and get both feet off the ground at the same time. If you can't hop, now you can always just raise the heels off the ground, but I'd like you to try it really small. Okay, this is really good for the joints, good for the lymphatic system, and that, it means it's good for the immune system. Right here, it's kind of like a little bounce. Excellent. Come on. One minute. You know where we're going after this, right? 10 burpees. Mini burpees, right? Because we're not putting in that push-up or that jump. Stay with me. Try and get both feet off the ground now. Notice how I keep a bend in my knee. Five, four, three, two, ten burpees. Let's go. Like you hop it back if you can.
Keep going. We're on five, four, come on, come to standing, three, remember that's what makes it mobility training. Good job. Now we're going to just hop on one leg. 30 seconds here, 30 seconds on the other leg. And little hops. That's it, come on. Switch it out. Whatever leg you were on. Yeah. Kind of like a modification of that hop. Remember, you can just raise off that heel, okay? You don't have to hop, but give it a try. Even if you do three, even if you do one, even if you do half of one, even if you do one, take a break and come back, yeah? All right, inchworms, 10 of them, let's go. Come on, and back, good job. Bring that butt down, take your time, walk it out, feel the work. We are halfway through the inchworms. We have five more. Come to standing each time for me, please. Remember, you can bend your knees if you need to and drop to those knees. Four more. Come on. That's it. Are you with me? We're not done the cardio just yet. Stay with me. Come on. Last inchworm. And now some jumping jacks. One minute. Let's go. <laughs> I messed up the arms and legs there. Well, that's all right. Come on. Any variation of jumping jack. Okay. You don't have to. Put the hands over the head today. You don't have to move both feet at the same time. Up to you. One minute. Stay with me. That's it, looking good. Bend those knees. Three, two, ten burpees, mini burpees, let's go. Ten. Three more, two more, last one, one minute skater. Nice and steady, you need some lateral movement here. Come on. 
This is round number eight. You know we don't stop at eight. Well, sometimes we do. Oh well, guess what number we're going to? Just 10, okay? So we have two more rounds after this. Ten more seconds of skaters. Good. Let's do inchworms. Ten of them. Keep the body strong. So things are tense. You're not a wet noodle, you're an uncooked noodle. Nice and firm. Walk it out into that plank position. Stretch it out. This is five. We have five more. Remember your pace, okay? Nice and strong. Try and touch those toes without bending the knees. And then if you need to bend the knees, then bend it. We have three more. Make them really good. Okay, we have two more rounds and we are done the cardio. Come on. We have one more inchworm. And then we head into those two rounds. Come on, one minute of cardio. Big, big guns here. Are you ready? Basketballers. If you need to step in, step out, that's an option. Okay. Come on. One minute. It's round number nine. We're just going to ten. Bend your knees here. 10 seconds and then 10 burpees. Good. 10 burpees, let's go. And round number nine. Five more. Come with me. Step. I'll try and hop back. One more. One minute. Toy soldiers. Round 10. Come on. Knee kicked to protect that joint. Get it to hip height, at least, come on. Touch the opposite hand to the foot. Chest up, belly in. Nearly there, come on. Back it up, 10 inch worms to finish. Let's go. To plank, walk it back, stand it up. All aspects, even if you go slower. 
even if you go faster. Come on. We have five more to go. Come on. Let's go five. Walk it out. That's it. Oh. Four more to go. Walk it out. You got this. Three. I asked you earlier, is sweat dripping from you? Now it's pouring down my nose. This is two. Come on. Last one. Can I see you do like a number one fabulous king of the hill pinch worm and stand it up take a break good job that was about 20 minutes of cardio catch your breath well done ah. Ah. wipe drink ah. Good job, well done. <clears throat> now some strength training. All right, catch your breath for a little bit longer for me, please. I wanna show you what we're doing today. Now we've done this once before, okay? We'll only be doing five, but we'll be doing them repeatedly, all right? If you need to go slower again, that's an option. I want you to come up onto your toes, take the knees forward. You're gonna come down into like a little squat, like you were, you know, picking something off the ground or talking to someone, a tiny person. And then I want you to tap your knees on the ground and stand back up. Remember those? Now, if you need to, and you need to use your hands, go right ahead, okay? Yeah, that's gonna help with the knee joint, right? Because the knee is completely flexed in this position. Actually, it really also helps the ankle when we dip forward, okay? Yeah, so that's your option. Second thing we've never done together, legs are hip width apart, I'm gonna show you from the side. I'm gonna take those knees forward and I want you to like alternate. But you're gonna keep the weight on the balls of the foot and you're gonna imagine that there's something you're gonna push down with your heel, all right? We're gonna do a little bit more of those 10. Are you ready? Let's go. Pick up your weights, please. Legs hip width apart. 10 squats. 10. Nine, come as deep as you can. Eight. Seven, good job. Six. Five. Four. Three, two, and one. Put the weights down. Let's take it forward for five. Tap, five. Come to standing. Come on, down and tap. Four, come to standing. Remember you can use your hands if you want. Three, yeah, it's an option. And two, give me one more. One, these are really good for the joints in the lower leg. Excellent. Let's stack it up on the balls. Alternate 10, nine, eight, seven, six. Are you pumping? Five, four, bend the knees. Three, two, and one. Good job, pick up your weights. 10 squats. Let's go. One more. Ten hammer curls. Let's go. Ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, thumbs up, 
five, four, three, two, get rid of the weights, up onto your toes, knees forward, tap it down, five, four, three, it's really important here that you tap those knees to the ground. So if you need to get the hands to the ground, do that. Two. Yes, excellent. One more time. Good job. Come to standing. Legs hip width. Lift the heels off the ground. Keep the weight in the balls of the foot. Let's go. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Bend it deeper if you want a little bit more. Four, three, two, and one each side. Good, pick up the weights. 10 squats. Let's go. Give me one more. Hammer curls, give me 10. Drive it up to the shoulders. Now we're overhead press, 10. One more, get rid of the weights. You know what we're doing now, right? Knees forward, let's go. Five. Four. Three. Now notice how I kind of lean back my body to help. You can do that too. Watch, two. Use my hands for balance. Last one. Good. Legs a little bit more narrow than that. Lift off the heels. Keep the weight in the balls of the foot. Pump it out. Let's go. Ten. Nine. Bend the knees. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Come on. Four. Three. Two. One each side. Pick up your weights. Like hip width, 10 squats. We're building, can you see that? Can you feel that? Give me one more squat. Hammer curls. Give me one more hammer. Up to the shoulders. Ten narrow. Give me one more narrow. Keep it at the shoulders. Take it out. Lat raise. See how I'm keeping the dumbbell close?
Get rid of the weights. Knee taps. Three, two, one. If you need to go slower, go ahead. If you only need to do one in this set, go ahead. Try. Try. This is going to help with your mobility. Just because you're not doing it today doesn't mean you'll never do it. Two more. One more. Good. Come to standing, everyone. Good. Lift the heels off the ground. Keep the weight in the balls of the foot. Let's go. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Bend the knees. Come on. Two and one. Notice the knees are going over the toes. Nice for the knees. Pick up your weight. Ten squats. Let's go. Deep as you can. We're not rushing it. But we're not taking any rest. One more squat. Ten hammer curls. Take it up to the shoulder. Now we're overhead. One more. Keep it close to the shoulder. Lap. Tricep extensions. Let's go. Five, four, three, two, one. Get rid of the weights. Knee taps. Let's go. If you need to do, use those hands, go ahead. Come on. There's no right or wrong way to do this, right? You just do the best that you can. Yes, and you maximize on that posture as you get better. I think that was four or five. One more for good measure because I lost track of counting. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> All right. Balls of the feet. Let's go. Ten. Nine. Alternate. Eight. Seven. Push through the heel. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One each side. Good. Pick up the weights. Ten squats. Let's go. Chest up, chin up. Two more. Hammer curls. Two. 
Te mor. Take it to the shoulder. Narrow overhead. Two. Lat raise, keep the dumbbell close. Two more. Try some extensions. So in control. One more. Good. Shrubs. One more, get rid of the weight. Knee taps, five of them. Let's go, you ready? Come on, do what you can. Five, I'm gonna count this time. Four, slow and controlled. Three. Two. Give me one more. Good job. Come to standing wherever you're at. Lift your heels off the ground. Bend your knees. Let's go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Both sides. Good. Pick up the weights. 10 squats. Let's go. Deep as you can. Give me one more squat. Hammer bicep curls. Let's go. Give me one more. Take it up to the shoulders. Now we're overhead. Give me one more. Black dumbbells close to the chest. One more, tricep extensions. Shoulder shrugs. Front raises. Mm -hmm. 
One more. Get rid of the weights. Knee taps. Ready? Let's go. Come on. One more. Oh, excellent job. Off those heels, bend the knees. Let's go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Pick up the weights. Let's go. 10 squats. We did 10 squats in round 1. So this is round one. Come on, deep as you can. One more. Hammer bicep curls. We did that round two. So this is round two. One more. Bring it all the way to shoulders. Round three. That's it. Round four. Remember what they are? One more. Round five. Come on. One more. Round six. Round seven. All right, this is round eight, new move, alternating lunge. Round eight. You have an idea of where we're going now, right? Come on. One more each side. Get rid of the weight. Knee taps, just five. Come to standing one more time. Yes, use those hands if you need. Good. Oh. Lift the heels and the knees. Ten. Good. 
Good job. Pick up your weights, guys. Round nine. Let's go. Let's go. One more, bicep. One more, take it to the shoulder, overhead, narrow. One more, lap, close. One more, tricep. One more, shoulder shrug. Good job, front raise. Alternating, forward lunge, give yourself some room. Come on, this is four, this is three, two more each side, underhand bicep curl, round nine. One more, get rid of the weights. Last round, knee taps, round 10. Let's go. Good job, that was five. On the balls of the feet, bend the knees, alternate. And one. Oh, grab your weights, round 10. Last time through. And we end with squats, let's go. Two more. Hammer curls. Two 
Two more. Up to the shoulders, overhead. Flat raise. Tricep extension. Shoulder shrug. Front raise. Alternating forward lunge. I know, I'm tired too. This is our last round. We have two more exercises. Two more lunges each leg. Underhand, bicep. Squats to finish. Let's go. Get rid of those weights. <sighs> Oh, shake it out, watch it out, tap it out, white drink, let's cool down, awesome. So rounds of 10 today, give us about a 20 minute cardio, that round of 10. And the strength gave us about a 36 minute round. Good. Get something to drink and let's cool it down together. Mm. All right, side tap for me. Push those weights to the side. You don't want to trip on them. And I'll just add a Shoulder roll. Good. That's it. All right, keep those legs wide. Roll those shoulders forward. Good job. Stretching out the bicep. Tricep. Lean over to the side. Yeah. 
Release, shoulder. Good job, shake it out. Side tap. Add those shoulders. And keep it open. Left side, bicep. Tricep. Bring your legs together. Tilt it to the side. Shoulder. That's it. Good. Shake it out for me, please. Let's go to the legs. All right, hold the weight onto the left leg. Grab the right, give me a quad stretch. Try and grab it with both hands. Pull that knee back. Try not to let the knee go out, but straight back. Good. Other side. Try and hold it with both hands. Good. Back to the right leg. Hamstring. Flat back. Square those toes. Take a look. If you can, reach for the toes. Flatten the back. Chest up. Bend the knee a little bit more. A little deeper. Okay. Other side. First, just square it. Take a look, reach for it if you can, flatten the back, and now push the chest up, pull on the toe. Bend the knee a little bit more. Good, shake it out. Calf stretch, big step back, and we're done. Other side. Good job, shake it out for me, please. Ah, big inhale, and exhale. Again, big inhale, and exhale. Oh, this time bring it up, hold it up, and then just let it fall forward. Thank you so much for working out with me today. Oh, I am tired. I hope you are too. I hope you feel worked out. I hope you tried some new moves today. Those knee taps, awesome things for the knees. Um, have a great day.